Hey guys, so you've probably heard by now about this new feature in Android 7.1 called Quick Shortcuts, which is sort of like the way 3D Touch works on the iPhone. Uh, obviously, if you don't have a Nexus or a Google Pixel phone, you probably don't have Android 7.1 on your device yet, so this is just a quick demo to show you how this works. So obviously, these are the app shortcuts. You just tap and hold on an icon and you get let's see if we can get more there you go Evernote has some more so this is how you pop up the shortcuts now don't worry Android's home screen pretty much still works the same if you tap and hold and these pop up you can still just drag the icon and place it anywhere the shortcuts just disappear and you use it as you've used it before now this is all followed by a quick vibration feedback and it's very clear to me what I'm doing, uh, it's very natural, so props to Google for doing this this way. Now we can also take one of these shortcuts, like take a selfie, and place it over here. Now what this will do is it will launch the camera app and it will send me to the selfie camera. There we go. Of course I can also use it from here without a shortcut. There we go again. And that's pretty much it. Now, in contrast, here's how it works on the iPhone. We've got the iPhone 7 here. If I hard press, I get this menu, which works pretty much the same way. But uh, if I hard press and I try to get a shortcut, obviously I can't. And there's another thing. If I accidentally hard press, I cannot move the icon around. So you've got to be careful with this. Just minor differences, uh, which obviously may mean how these features are going to evolve in the future but we'll see about that for now that's how quick shortcuts work on android 7.1 thanks for watching